hello and welcome to my another video today we will discuss about how to compare two values in excel uh, which is there in the shape on all nice so let's get go it so in this video uh, as you can see i have a shape point uh, library and uh, we i have two uh, books which is book one book and book one dot access so if I'll just open and just show you uh, the columns. So I got like two columns, uh, first name and last name. First name is I I gather uh, Australian opening Australian opening batsman. Uh, so David Warner, Steve Smith, and Glenn Maxwell. Glenn Maxwell used to be a lower order, so I just pop up his name in the top order. <laughs> All right, so and the um, book one dot xsls so it has only two um, two rows so what i will do that i'll open to the uh, book one uh, column first name to book uh, column uh, first name and try to see if the values are present or not so let's uh, move to our uh, flow so I'll create a new flow so in my flow I'll create a new flow uh, instance and I'll select this manually trigger a flow uh, I just manually trigger it and I'll just uh, name the name, name of the Excel would be <coughs> name the name of the Excel would be uh, match values and uh, Okay, so what I'll do, I'll just select um, uh, list rows, list rows in a table. So I'll uh, uh, I'll choose my um, communication side, document library, is a documents, and file. So I'll I'll first, I'll loop into my book one, and first I loop into book one, and then then a loop would be the book. Uh, sorry, the main loop will be book and the inner loop will be book one. So, uh, so main, main with some book lab and I'll just select playable one. So, over here, what I will do, I will create I add initialize the variable. Initialize, initialize the variable and I'll just say uh, value form and i'll just say false uh, i'll do the i'll call the another uh, list rows in a table another one documents and i'll choose this time i'll choose book one and the table should be table one table one and over here if I say if uh, condition if uh, first name of the yeah so first name of the one if it is in the in the first name of the value two yep all right so that's fine uh, so what it will do that it will the f uh, the above loop is for the main uh, book book table uh, book dot xsls table one and the low and the below table below loop would be on the book one dot xsls one so as you can see uh, if i can just show you over and out all right so what i'll do that if if first name equal to so over here i'll just say value set variable and uh, say value found true else i'll just mention that it's not found okay so and the very last in the in this loop and i'll just check uh, i'll put the condition and uh, say if value found equals to false then i'll just email myself that the value is not found 
Uh, so I'll just go over there and uh, send email. Send email and I'll accept. And to to myself, I just say to myself. Yep. And first name. That is first name of. Uh, table one sorry I couldn't find the first name and first name of the table one yep this one I did a bit of a mistake so I need to set uh, this I need to I need to reset the values every time it's passed through the loop so just make it as a false so that every time when you start from the from the from the other from the other value so it will it will make itself as a false set variable set variable and then false false and all right okay I think this time it should run mm, run pro mm -hmm. done so oh, sorry we couldn't find the name Glenn and um, title is first name Glenn thank you guys thanks a lot see you next time Bye.